A program to help veterans with home repair gets the credit for keeping a 98-year-old woman in her home. Nine on your side, Natasha Williams shows you how. She arrived with a welcome fitting an American hero. Anna feels a 98-year-old WAC, or Women's Army Corps combat nurse, who is an honored guest and recipient of what she calls a gift with no words to describe. But there's a lot of things that needed to be done that uh, I just didn't have the money to do it. The Bond Hill home she shares with her adult daughter was falling apart until her daughter heard about the People Working Cooperatively program. We had no means to um, fix anything, and so all I could do was pray. They say their prayers were answered because of volunteers like David Legg, a retired engineer turned home fix it guru. It's a new job he loves. It's I'm saying I one of the best one feelings you can week. ever get is to be able there to help um, someone out doing me that, that have done things for you, talk. and it's time we all they give back. Pain. For Anna Phil, she says what they did for her and her daughter is all the thanks she needs. They have uh, been uh, uh, so helpful to me because uh, they have allowed me to to remain be, to remain for probably for the rest of uh, the time I have left. Uh, in my own home. Now you can help veterans currently on a waiting list for home repair assistance by donating to the Ramp It Up Veterans Campaign. For information, go to WCPO.com. All right, Natasha, thanks.